Thank you, President. Action Canada makes the statement on behalf of Black Queer Dogs, Banana Club, Botswana Trans Initiative, Love Lost Life, Mamati Human Rights Hub, Uranti, the Southern African Litigation Center, and the Sexual Rights Initiative. We regret that Botswana received and noted several recommendations on decriminalizing abortion, on repealing Section 167 of the Penal Code, and on ensuring access to legal gender recognition. Botswana must eliminate discrimination against women and ensure their access to legal, safe and affordable sexual and reproductive health services, including abortion, which Botswana still criminalizes, and gender affirming care. Though some progress has been made in repealing laws criminalizing sexual acts between consenting adults, Botswana still criminalizes same-sex relations between consenting lesbian, bisexual, and queer women. Section 167 of the Penal Code still remains and it can still be used against those deemed to commit acts of gross indecency both in public and in, a, in private. Finally, despite the Botswana High Court order, the government of Botswana is yet to introduce a clear administrative process for legal gender recognition for transgender and gender diverse persons, which would enable them to change their gender marker. As a result, transgender people are still required to go through a costly and taxing process of seeking a court order for them to change uh, their gender marker on their documentation. We therefore call upon the government of Botswana to one, decriminalize abortion and ensure that safe abortion services are accessible, affordable, and available across the country up to 28 weeks of pregnancy. Two, repeal section 167 of the penal code. Three, adopt policy guidelines on legal gender recognition and simplify the process of transgender and gender diverse persons seeking gender recognition by eliminating the need for a court order and by providing gender affirming health care at public health facilities. Thank you.